There are four parts in this lesson. The on start and forever functions. Various inputs. Learn variables. Logical function if then else. Display number and string inside on start or forever. Click the show number block from the basic category. Enter the number 1, 2, 3 inside the blank. Drag it and place into the on start function. It shows 1, 2, 3 once when the micro bit begins. However, when the same block is placed inside the forever function, it repeats continuously. The show number block accept only numbers. The show string block accept both numbers and letters. Let's learn how to design the input from the user. Drag the on button A press from the input category. Each time when you press A, 1, 2, 3 will appear once. Learn how to create and apply variables. Create a variable num. Set the variable num to be the value 5. Show the value each time when you press A. Remain the numbers for one second, then it will disappear with the clear screen block. Now press A shows 5, it disappears after a second. The variable is able to keep the value. When you press B, it shows the value of the variable. Now, let us set the variable to take the number 3. Press A, it shows 3 for a second. Press B, it shows 3 and stays. Let us apply variables to create a counter.
time when you press A, the number will increase by 1. And each time when you press B, the number will be reduced by 1. Press A plus B to reset to 0. Now, we change to show that each time when you press A, the number will increase by 2. Press B reduces by 1. Create two variables, num1 and num2. Each time when you press A, num1 will increase by 1. And each time when you press B, num2 will increase by 1 as well. Press A plus B will give you the sum of num1 and num2. Let's look at the example. Increase num1 to 3. And num2 to 2. Press A plus B to give you the sum of 5. logical function if then else now let us create two variables num1 and num2 Each time when you press A, num1 will increase by 1. And each time when you press B, num2 will increase by 1 as well. Set num1 and num2 to 0 each time when you restart. Each time when you press A plus B, a decision will be made.
if the sum of num1 and num2 is greater than 6, it shows b, otherwise it shows s. See you in the next lesson. Thank you. Created using Powtoon.